Hey there, Fumbles here, and welcome back to Hard West. I didn't forget. It's just been a while since I've been able to play this. Uh, let's see, the neighbor's house. Florence's parents didn't survive the raid. Young dead, weeping, she followed at home. <clears throat> Meanwhile, while you were gone, your father had a visitor, a well-dressed gentleman with a peculiar accent who seemed to appear out of nowhere. His magnificent cologne almost concealed his curious sulfur aroma. Could he be? No. That was madness. The gentleman was quite persuasive, convincing father to spend most of his cash on a lucky amulet. He was fed up with struggling, running, yeah. Still, things improved. Father swiftly found new digging sites and extraction was efficient. Soon he was able to buy a better mining license. Excellent. More cash. <clears throat> Where to go? Um, let's see. Sorry, it's been a while since I played. <laughs> Prospector's camp. Uh, let's go for the best one. Why not? Learned how to retrieve gold using a sluice trough. Those things are big fun, let me tell you. When I was a kid, I had to pan gold with my dad. And not as a hobby. <laughs> he thought we were going to strike it rich. We lived in Northern California. So... We, uh, we had a, a homemade sluice trough, and, uh, it, it wasn't that much fun, you know, digging, digging out mud from the riverbed and basically hauling it over to, uh, to the thing was, was kind of a pain. Anyway. You collected the placer gold deposits. All right. Need to make money, not lose it. Yes, we'll do the 40. All right. It wasn't so great because we're getting robbed by the Mexican. Horse. Then the quartz stones with the pickaxe. Mexican. Damn it. Alright. What do we do from here? Went to parlay with the criminal, hoping to appeal to his kinder nature. She knew you would never allow it, so left without telling you. <clears throat> but the Mexican had no better nature to appeal to. Florence never returned. You immediately prepared to get her out. All right. That was a mistake, Mr. Mexican. Uh, we should go to the store. We should go and buy some new weapons, maybe. Uh, you pay for the information about my needs. Uh, sure. Several specialists who might be able to help you out. Excellent. I don't know. Visited a small frontier town made up of miners. <clears throat> See what we can get. Ooh, harmonica gun. <laughs> uh, I see. I see what they did there. I wonder if that's a real thing. This one looks good. 
Wait a second. A Gatling gun? Heavy pepper box. Oh yeah. I want that one. I don't really need a Derringer deadly, even if it is deadly. Get rid of a regular six-shooter and the Derringer, probably. Let's see, 12 bullets. Looks like everything else it does is the same. I gotta go with this one, the heavy pepper box. So I'm not selling my soul to the devil. Then turned on his heels and left the crossroads after a few steps. The night was crisp and clear. Yeah, no deals with the devil. The man's eyes had been sewn shut with a crude twine. He sat perfectly still. Gun in his holster on the ground, a little close to you. Okay. You have grabbed his stuff and made a run for it, but then there was that gun. Grabbed the stash and ran. No, I'm not stealing from the old man. Oh, I got a blessing from the old man. Hmm. When nothing happens, I always feel like I did something wrong. I don't know if that's necessarily true, but... <clears throat> Let's go get some God. Reverend Gervais had a reputation of being a miracle worker for a price. He could heal the most serious ailment. Those with less cash could leave a... I eh. think we'll come back to church. Yeah. I guess there's nothing for it. Nothing over this way. Just the mountains. Gold mine off. 
office? What do they have in here? Local entrepreneur Falk Lang opened a mine several years ago. Now that he was retired, he was willing to sell his knowledge on hard rock gold mining. Hmm. Guess I'll wait till I can afford that. places. Pharmaceutical shop? Shop featured all kinds of drugs and chemicals. Old Deacon Spires took great care to keep plenty of copper slabs. Okay. Mercury pots on hand. I like Cheech. The repeater, definitely. He's got the ten of spades. Yeah, I don't, I don't really like that one. Equalization. I don't like that one either. Take these as backups since we have a slot for them. I don't even know if we can use them. <clears throat> now I should have. I should have the new gun. Take some tobacco. No, wait. The sawed off cobra. So, I'm gonna be doing most of the attacking. Pop is gonna be the, uh, like the sniper. So should I have a gun and a rifle? Like a pistol and a rifle? Or... Ugh. Oh wait! We have the heavy pepper box. Yeah. Sawed off in the pepper box. the repeater is the best one, right? Wait. That does 5 damage, 4 damage, 4 damage, um, heavy cover is 2. He's got tobacco. I should pop out 2 rifles? options which is not a bad thing get me wrong it's always good to have options in a game Lawrence was locked up it was time to go get her out and get some payback you talked with Florence through a barred window 
To get her out, you'd need the key. This same key could also be used to lock the guards inside the house. Okay. Other. Oh, okay. So I can basically just walk in. Check things out. Florence? Is she... Is she in this room? Oh... No, wait. She's... Uh... Okay. She's in that room. I... Okay, that's the room I need the key get into, so. Let's see. Get Pop to a good sniping position. Then... Can I walk into his field of vision? Or is he gonna freak out? Cruise around. Alright, there's that guy. Go upstairs, Pop. Hmm, can we go to the roof? Still scared to walk into their vision. I just don't know if they're gonna react. Is that Cheech? Maybe. Looks like him. Go to the window. Go to the window <coughs> and wait for my signal. <laughs> Cruising around, guys. Checking things out. I mean, not checking things out. Just hanging out. You know. Yeah. Get better aim. The additional number on a suspicious enemy. Use the subdue ability. To delay their reaction, subdue doesn't start combat. Okay. Suspicious. jail key. Because I assume what that hand is up there. You can only see three out of the, what, six I can see, I, I know are there right now. Three is not a terrible number, but
That is definitely Cheech. And I can see five. Again, sorry. I forgot how to play this game. <laughs> Alright. Let's go grab that key. The key was yours. You could release her right away. Or first, lock the guards inside to make sure they didn't try to Which stop sounds you. sounds like a good idea, but then I don't get to kill people. And I'm not a big fan of leaving the enemy alive. It just doesn't sound like a good idea. feel bad about killing Cheech, but not that bad. Can I subdue him? Shoot the target? walk up right behind him, right? He's not really ready for it. Now, eat your tobacco. Your tobacco. Chaw on your tobacco. Nice and relaxed for the gunfight ahead. And what does subdue actually do? I mean, to subdue for three turns based on character heat. Bye. Sorry, Cheech. You had to go down. Like the dog you are. Alright, Pop. Let's make these shots count. We got a two threes and a four. We should take out that four first. Boom. Is that him? Vengeance was that the Mexican? Was Not bad. Shouldn't have taken my girlfriend hostage. Now you're all gonna die. Why don't you go for the furthest one, I think. Seventy one percent. Seventy one percent. Better. Kill that guy. Oh, man. One. <gasps> I can see that, that guy that I just shot. How do I get Florence and get out of here? Let's 
still see that one guy. Oh, impossible to hit. Oh, okay. 27%. Ugh. Relic. Here's those relics have a soothing effect on all witnessing their mindless destruction. Okay. On all. That's not the best for here. I think I used that in the last one. Maybe I didn't. Uh oh. Ooh, miss. Thank you. Oh, that's a bad spot, buddy. Yeah, you're going down. Ah! It's with the ones! And he got positive luck out of that. He got shot, and it was positive? I don't see how that's fair. Man. Let's see, 59%. Cover here. I think I should. Get behind this cover and shoot that guy. Oh, wait. Can't shoot that guy. Oh, but he's reloading. <laughs> well, that saved me. I shoot. This guy has a shotgun. 100%. Yep. Oh, I wish I could get close to guys and shoot them. Well, I did with Cheech, but still. Thirty four per cent. Which is no good. I gotta I gotta do something. I miss him with the cone shot. Forty nine percent. Yeah, I'm going to take that one. Fifty nine. Oh, that's even better. Oh, man. <laughs> I like that gun. Really, guy? You know Pop's gonna kill you, right? 
one back here. Now I should have 100% on this guy. 57. 64. Oh, I can fan with this one. Should I fan this guy? Insufficient action points. Ugh. I don't need to ricochet. All right, take the. I'll take the. 57. Nice! From the hip! <laughs> this is the last guy, right? Should be able to nail him, no problem. Seven? Yeah. Oh. Still didn't take him out. Twenty nine, that sucks. Possible to hit. And a better firing position. But if I do that I won't have enough action points. Go right outside his circle and shoot him in the face. I knew it. See? Insufficient action points. 57. Bring on. Sawed off. Oh my god. That guy is. You are the luckiest guy in the world. All right, I'm pretty lucky too. And now Pop has nothing to do. Inside his cone of death, or his his circle of death. Go behind this pillar. What? Oh. Okay, so there's another guy. to go down. <clears throat> oh. There we go. 59. We're gonna ban you. Take this. Oh ho ho! Oh ho ho! Lucky goes down spurting blood. All 
All right, Pop, start coming out of the of the house. Well, you stay here. Maybe you do have a chance. Boom. Florence was free, and there was no one left to pursue you. At last, Florence was free. Awesome. All right, that's the end. So take care. And as always, you'll see me next time.